Okay, about to do a few uh, quick sound samples with the McGrath Mini amplifier. First trick, of course, is turning it on. I put the switches are all on the back, but they're on the corners where they're relatively easy to reach around and get to. Power switch comes on, the LED starts out red, indicating the 5 volts is on, but it'll gradually fade in. Uh, blue LED as well, indicating the uh, high voltage has come on as it powers up, as it heats up. Here it goes. Uh, so the tube rectifier is now delivering high voltage and she's ready to play. So with uh, neither of these LEDs on, the uh, gain sections are not on, and it's a very simple single uh, 12AX7 stage right into the EL84 power amp, so it's a little bit similar to an old 1950s era Fender Champ at this point, like a 5F1. Uh, very clean sound, good sound, usable sound. There's also a switch on the back, a gain switch. It's down right now. And I'll switch it up. As you can hear, it gives it a little more gain and a little more uh, edge, a little more distortion uh, because it opens up a uh, feedback loop in the front end. So it's more than just changing the gain, really. Changes the harmonic structure quite a bit. Uh, in any case, now we can turn on, take the master volume down a bit, turn on the first stage. Here we go. This is the linear preamp, kind of my own design there. Uh, this format is a uh, frequency selectable boost or cut, so you can either give it a, uh, a mid-range hump at a desired frequency, or you can scoop it. And as you slide the frequency around on that scoop, it gives a Something very similar to the action of a phaser. It's kind of cool. But, and you can gain this channel up quite